I'm a little concerned about Kevin. He has a problem right now, so it needs to be fixed. This goes by so fast. <laughs> wow. Just trying to keep up with all the different things that are going by. This is unbelievable. And then you're looking for cardboard. You have to get that off because it'll jam the equipment. I was sweating bullets because I know how expensive that equipment is. I missed it. I missed it. I would just send the model one. We're jammed from one side of that belt to the other. OK, I'll send them all to lunch. Cardboard line plugged up down there. Oh, uh, Randy, we're going to take our half hour punch lunch right now. OK. OK? Some big piece of cardboard or something got in there. So, um. I tried to grab it. It was way out there underneath a bunch of trash, and I saw the corner of it. And I tried to lift it, you know, catch it with one hand, and I missed it. So I, paused. I hope I didn't mess something up. I don't think I'm very good at this job, so that's that's a little frustrating for me. And I know I was putting the wrong thing, you know, I grabbed. <laughs> What's happening? <laughs> right on time. I had to punch in. I only have a half hour lunch. I had to punch it back in or I get docked. You get in trouble? I can get docked two minutes every minute that I'm late. Doesn't seem very fair. That's the way Kevin does that. Where is he? He's sitting right here in his office. There's cameras up there. So he's watching us constantly. Is that the most frustrating thing to you? I wish they didn't have it. The policy is, for every minute that you're late, you're docked too. You know, I'm, I'm president and chief operating officer. I ought to know about things like this. This is precisely why I wanted to go undercover. Come on, Randy. I'm coming. But I really appreciated working with you. And when you and I were having lunch, you got up and bolted out of the lunchroom. You have to clock back in exactly on 30 minutes. Well, I knew that wasn't our policy. That really bothers him. So I'm going to talk to Kevin about it, and we're going to get that fixed. Well, I appreciate you coming up and trying it out. <laughs> I'm a little concerned about Kevin. He has a problem right now, so it needs to be fixed. Hey, Kevin. Hello. Larry O'Donnell. Nice to meet you. I understand you had somebody working at your recycling facility last week. Yes, we did. Did you meet the employee? No, I did not. Would it uh, surprise you to hear it was me? Uh, One of the reasons I w I've done this is I want to understand what things that are causing frustration with our employees. I've seen the way you ended up implementing our policy about 30 minutes for lunch, what frustration it's causing. You know, if they're three minutes late, we don't penalize them. And that seems to be the thing that is just really frustrating. Sure. I think we can figure out sure. a, a better way to do it than, than what we're doing. Can I count on you to get that done?